like Kanye's real truth with music gonna come when he do another show that's gonna tell us if they affected him or not I don't think they had but we gonna see hold on I missed that what did you say about Kanye uh, what? When, it, when they let him and he didn't try to do shows they just been canceling them when he ate, when he go do a show in that arena that's gonna be the moment it's gonna truth. sell out instantly instantly damn i it's just i just got back out. what you said was the real tale what what would you say was when the real ye, tale was it when, tour and numbers yeah, touring, or touring yeah when, like when kanye go to uh when kanye go to do a show in one of the marinas and that motherfucker don't do what it normally do then you know they affected him no i'm gonna tell you what didn't happen they should have let him do them four shows he had but live nation canceled him on this shit they didn't fucked up because now adidas it then showed that Ye was the brand. Adidas then came back crawling on their knees. They lost down there half a billion. Was finna lose another billion. Now they forced it at the table with Ye to re-sign the deal. So everything they thought they took, they giving back. Mm -hmm. It's gonna make them even bigger, guy. Right, because the uh, contract Live Nation gave, let's say he was getting 20 a show at that time, which I know that's low. But let's say he getting 20 a show at that time back then. Now it's 25. The price that went up. Oh, he might tell him shit you. forty. Yeah, he might tell him you and go with they, you know, A E G. Oh, oh that's a man, fact. He just go to the ops. You right? Shit, yeah. man, not really. Hey, he's just making his money. He's doubling up on the back end. So they he's up on Yeah, they should have let him do them four shows. And if it was gonna happen to him, let it happen to him. Instead, they didn't. They blocked the shows. Since then, Adidas and lost money. Came back. Yay, we need you back. We're sorry. So was that not the the best business move in music history? Like, was that not the best business move, like, ever? Well, like, I don't think it wasn't a move. It just happened. You don't and think Jay did that intentionally, Uncle? I think nah, he did, Wack, nah, because remember nah, he, he did that video Uncle, where he I think was he like, did I'm do it basically like, I'm free. Nah, he ain't. He, ain't. No? he, didn't, he didn't think them people was going to turn on him like that. You don't think so, Uncle? No, I believe I Wack. No. Wack knows yeah. So. Well, I know you know. Let me yeah. tell you the reason why I that thought he didn't think them people look bro first of all he never said nothing wrong the nigga said i'm going defcon 3 which is readiness they took it and blew it up they nipsey hustled yay's comment bro so when you talk about uh AG, well hold on rewind Alex? back to that nipsey hustle, what you mean they nipsey hustled yay's comment that what they did they blew it out of proportion they made it seem like it was. Oh, that it like when you said the Nipsey Hustle shit. I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bro. Hey, and I'm in total agreement with I you did. on that, Unc. They, they blew, blew that shit all, all the way up, man. Yeah, they blew it all the way up to where people didn't even know why they was talking and what they was talking about. They were just like, oh, fuck it. Yeah, what the shirts we're going to order? That's true. Like that's they true. Because at the end of the day, it was a, it was a gang shoot. That's, that's all it was. It wasn't like. You know, you say the old lady is some crazy shit. The car exploded, caught on fire, some shit. It was a gang shoot, right? And they took that, and and you half these people didn't know. They were like, "Oh my God, why did he?" They didn't. It was a regular, some ghetto ass gang shit going on, and they blew it up. So with Ye, he said, "Um, you know, I'm gonna wake up in the morning, go DevCon three on the Jews. That means readiness." Defcon one, two, three, four, five. It me it's certain one means attack, destroy. He said, I'm going into readiness mode. They took that shit and blew it up. Oh, he disrespected the Jewish community. Where? He said death. Defcon three. <laughs> that that's a military terminology, which you can Google what Defcon three means. It means to get ready for war, yeah. The readiness, it's nothing. This is really nothing, honestly. They took that sh and blew that shit. <laughs> like they said he was like he was gonna launch nuclear they weapons did. on it. They went crazy. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> like he's saying I'm about to The only reason I say that, though, no, no, listen, the reason why I said what I said, cause I saying it like, all right, so he knew 
like that we we all knew he wanted to negotiate his contracts with him he'd been talking about that for like a year like you know he wanted more creative control and the numbers was off and shit like that he was very vocal about that right so they was not trying to let him do any renegotiations he was vocal about that as well like they wasn't trying to budge on that and i feel like him making the comments like going with this cancel culture using cancel culture against itself like i think he the first person to use cancel culture against itself like he got out of the contracts that he didn't want to be in the contract by saying things that like you said he, really, he, he, didn't didn't have a, he didn't have a problem with them kind you don't think so no you never heard him complain about his contract. it was the con creative he control that he was when it came to his creative, yeah, the creative control when huh? he wanted to be creative and have control over his ideas and his designs and no push no back on that him? no he was complaining that he wanted them to open up easy stores mm. right that was his complaint. I want Yeezy stores here, here, and there. And they like, uh, nah. We moving this shit online and through the stores we moving in there. If it ain't broke, we ain't fixing it. That was one. And then Unc, they was also putting out unauthorized colorways that he didn't like. He didn't want to put out and stuff like that. Like, they was trying to make the money. So, but that's my only point. Like, he clearly wanted something changed in, in what the creative process of going in. First of I just all, feel like just, he, know this, just know this, bro. Just because a nigga saying something don't mean nothing. If you think Adidas is going to go put something out that they're not authorized to put out and leave they sell wide open to a breach, you crazy in a motherfucker. I think they had the right to do it. Huh? I just think that he, he wanted to change. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think he they had the Man, right. That nigga ain't read that red shoes and all that shit for no contracted he already a billionaire off of bro that shit don't that's why i'm right. bunk that's why i was like it was a big ass risk i was like what the f was he doing when it was he going wasn't down? no risk he just was running his mouth and expressing his opinion he didn't say i'm gonna say this and they gonna react like this and then this gonna happen and they gonna take this and this and this and then i'm gonna be free to do nah nigga. i'm being too conspiracy theory when he i get to that some yeah. He had no idea that they was gonna respond that way. It just worked out. It just worked out. And I think that kind of—it was just, it was just the freedom opened. of speech from Kanye. Yeah, and, that's it. Yeah, and then y'all see Kyrie was saying the same shit. Now they they on Kyrie and Ye now. You know what I'm saying? Think, what they? I think like, it kind of opened them up too. Like like y'all was saying, I don't think money was ever the issue. I think he was cool with you know getting that bill. You know whatever he was getting from Adidas. I just think you know uh, due to the shit that he said and the reaction that he that he got from it. He kind of had to see, like, damn, I guess the only way for me to, to do it is do it by my lonely type shit and, you know, like, build the complete infrastructure um, all the way around the board. And I think, you know, that was the only option that he was left with at that point in time. Yeah, but he didn't even attempt to do that. Yeah, not not yet. No, not how I yet. know? Because I attempted to do it. Yeah, because you put the bank. You, you tried to help him merge with the. the uh, yeah, he didn't even attempt to do that. He, he wasn't tripping. That's why I'm confused. Like, what's the end goal with bro? Like, that's what I like. I'm so confused on what he wanted. Ain't do. no end goal, bro. He wake up and he do what he do and he go to sleep. <laughs> he, like, I, he don't. I he think don't. That even, nigga just him. Yeah, he just him. So I don't, we think it too deeply as fans, like just thinking that the nigga so. Man, did you think out. that dude said I'm gonna say this and it's gonna lead to that, and it's gonna lead to me losing this and that and that that and this and this this, this that? Hell no. Damn, no. I, I true. I truly think he'll go back to Adidas because even you know you're already he, back. See it night like, like and for everybody in the audience, but like, gonna be on his a, terms. He back already. already yeah, because they got to get rid of that inventory. Remember, uh, uh, Dez, they got all that inventory, so they gonna have to sign a temporary deal with him if if nothing else. Man, ain't, ain't gonna be no temporary deal. It's gonna be what it. He all man. They had. Oh, man, they oh, had like. 150 different designs that he had already turned in and we ain't never seen yeah i looked at that as stealing like they they literally he he doing business with y'all and they we not buying them hoes with room. him like that no they knew if they stealing. released if they Bro, released we never that, buying them they hoes. couldn't put easy on. they couldn't put easy on it so it's a knockoff to us we ain't gonna wear it they couldn't yeah, put the easy I, shit on i don't on think it. they was willing to cut their losses like that and just say we ain't gonna do that'll so, ruin they right, company, I think bro. they um 
Yeah. No, nah, not they... only that, and then and then that that had more uh pain to it. Beyonce. Beyonce product dropped two hundred me. Mm-hmm. That's Adidas too. That was on they that was on them because they tried to make Beyonce yay in the in a clutch. Like it wasn't gonna happen. That's just not that wasn't No, nah, it's two, two different, different things. things. It just dropped it was already dropped. They look up, damn. Beyonce shit down two hundred. He down five. He only down five hundred because he ain't here. And he uh, he didn't. It worked out for him. But Kanye gonna tell you God got him. I went to him. I had the motherfucker financing. I had the people to make the shoes. Um, inventory would have cut like slightly because I think he does. He does ten million. Yeah, ten million. Ten million pairs of shoes each. You know each edition so we'd have been cut to like five six million but i told them the difference in the money gonna be the same because you ain't paying them and don't nothing say that we can't do two runs you know what i'm saying